Hey everybody, thanks for stopping by Greg's Beer Reviews today. Let's go see what's in the fridge today. Hey guys, welcome to Greg's Beer Reviews today. We're going to continue on with the Hot Butcher Beer. This is their Banana Gram. This is the big one, boys. This is a 10.5% Imperial Stout. Uh, on the can it says, brewed with banana and chocolate. 10.5% and it was put in the can 217 of 21. Uh, big 16 ounce can with a heat shrunk wrapper on it. These guys are up in Illinois around Chicago uh, and it looks pretty dark in the glass on the pictures are untapped here and the commercial description is exactly what's written on the bottom of the can here on the front. No IBUs so let's get it in the glass. Final beer of the evening. Drink responsibly guys, this is a big monster beer at 10.5%. Let's go down the center. Yeah, let's do the little swirly swirl so we can get a little head on this thing. Maybe. There we go. That's all I can get in there right now. Nice cascading effect from that pour. That's a good looking beer. That's a real good looking beer. A little over a finger of head on that pour very dark in the glass I'm not getting any light through it at all very nice looking hmm this is sent to me by Jeremiah who is with Hot Butcher for the World thanks a bunch Jeremiah I do appreciate it to the nose we go oh yes nice roasted malt hints of banana I'm getting chocolate and vanilla Oh, it smells awesome. Nice creamy khaki colored head, real tight bubbles. Very nice looking beer. What do you think? Cheers everybody. Cheers Jeremiah and everyone at Hot Butcher. Man, that is... That's a dessert beer for sure. That's chocolate, banana, Hints of vanilla, roasted malt, maybe a little caramel toffee in there. Man, that's super tasty. That's exactly what they say it is on the front of the can here. Bananas and chocolate. Well, mm, 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 mm. This would go well with any chocolate dessert, or could be your dessert. It is for me. I don't do dessert too much anymore. Yeah, I enjoy this as my dessert. Back in pour going in. Man, that's a good looking beer. Think we got it all out of there. I'm super impressed every time that I get a beer mile package from Jeremiah Hot Butcher. I know everything in that box is going to be tasty. And this one is no exception. Right out of the fridge. Let's go sip on it. Alright guys, I'm back. with sipping on it for over an hour. It's up to room temperature. Very tasty. The banana's there. The chocolate's there. Hints of vanilla. Uh, nice roasted malt taste. Alcohol's well hidden. A well-made beer, a very tasty beer. Uh, again, I would buy this if I could get it here, and you should too if you can get it, especially if you like this style. I mean, a dessert in a glass. 
Round two. Very tasty beer. Absolutely delicious. 98 for me on this one, guys. And if you say it's a 10, I would not argue with that one bit. It is very, very tasty beer. I don't think uh, Beer Advocate has any scores. Nope, they don't. I think only a couple of people have commented on it. Over to Untapped. 1,372 people have commented on this beer. Hmm, imagine that. And they have it at 4.22. I think it's a tad better than that. Uh, it is what it says it is on the front of the can. You're getting your, your banana and your chocolate, hints of vanilla, nice roasted malt, alcohol well hidden. What else would you ask for in a 10.5% Imperial Stout? So, 98 for me, guys. If you had Banana Graham from Hot Butcher for the world, let me know what you think. Till we meet again. Let's go see what's in the fridge.